An Act is the latest Ludicrums production and it is a location-based experience that you play with a mobile device. It's all about uh, exploring a city and doing challenges and it's been designed to be something that's really playful, something you can play with your family and your friends. So An Act was commissioned by the Coventry Mysteries Festival and each year the mysteries have a theme and the theme for this year is peace and reconciliation. So when you're visiting the locations, the challenges we're giving you are all about resolving conflict. And that's all based in the idea that in a conflict situation, there's no one right answer. Everyone will respond in a different way. We wanted to try and make something that when people go out, they feel like it's their journey, like they've got ownership over um, where they get to go next, what challenges they want to do um, and how they're going to respond to what they're learning. 35 years ago, the council had planned to demolish this street, but the residents, they gathered together to unite and save their homes and the mural on the wall, that represents their struggle and their determination. When your challenge is to describe or draw or take a photograph of people working hard together. <laughs> When new players come to the hub for the first time, we give them a few things, we give them a few goodies. So we give them a map of the locations, the different places where there are challenges, and there are kind of brief descriptions of the challenges on the back. We also show them the token. These, there's 21 of these hidden around the city, and that's what they're looking for, trying to find. Um, we also give them a passport for their journey and this is particularly um, when we're working with kids or people who like to draw or write um, and we encourage people that at each location they make a mark in their passport to help document their journey. We wanted to try and create something that has the right balance between uh, curation and automation. So the entire time you're out, you're texting or sending pictures and making phone calls, but we're back in the hub playing the game with you. So uh, as the players are going around their journey, we're, we're getting their answers via text message, via voicemail, pictures that they're taking using Instagram, and all of this information, including the locations where they've been, is all being stored and pulled together. Now when you visit a place, you normally get a postcard, um, but what we're trying to do is create a postcard that is unique to the person, and the postcard is the representation of all the information they've given us on their journey and it manifests itself in this generated print that we then print out and give them as a souvenir to take away. Oh, it was brilliant. It's, um, it's weird when you live in a city for, for most of your life, you don't notice things after a while. So um, being set challenges and having to actually look at places you're familiar with through fresh eyes uh, was, was fun. Um, it was kind of cool messing around at the fountain of the Belgrade because normally you get frowned at when you do that. And uh, being able to draw on the pavement at the cathedral was cool. Uh, but yeah, it was, it was a good experience. I think it's just, yeah, just seeing things differently and maybe just having a chance to stop and stand still at places you've walked through and never really visit as a destination, they're just places you walk through and actually seeing things that you've probably seen a hundred times before and never ever noticed. Absolutely fascinating. We've just meandered around the city and seen bits of the city that we've never seen before and we've also had lunch which was really, really jolly and it didn't rain. Fantastic. Thank you.